Hello food fans, and welcome back to Diner Bros. In this episode, I'm going to start on the Sushi Bros campaign. So, I will admit up front, I am not a seafood fan overall, so I really don't know the names of the different sushis and such. So, I'm going to probably just be calling the fish what I see them as, and leave it at that. I wanted to go ahead and get through Sushi Bros now, though, because they have announced that they're coming out with a new DLC soon, where I will be opening a taco restaurant. So I want to be fully caught up on the game before that happens. With that in mind, let's jump in and run a sushi restaurant. Okay, so most of the things are the same. The big difference here, having played this a bit before, is that I have to catch the fish before I can cook them. So let's go ahead and start catching some fish and making sushi. Yeah. Okay, that was not mm -hmm. a good catch there. There we go. Alright, we got one fish caught. Let's go ahead and catch another one here. We know we'll need it soon yeah. enough. Mm -hmm. This is always harder here at the beginning without a waitress. So, got to make it through this first level in order to get the waitress, make my life easier. Alright, so, got some yeah. fish ready. Mm -hmm. Now, I had, yeah. as I said, I had already played this through once, uh, uh -huh. but then I had an issue where uh, evidently one of the songs that plays in Sushi Bros was copyrighted so YouTube wouldn't let me have it up. So I decided I'm just going to redo it instead of trying to fight the copyright claim yeah. thing. So we won't have music mm -hmm. this time. Hopefully it'll still be a fairly entertaining video though overall. Yeah. No idea what this fish is supposed to be here. Mm -hmm. uh, as it, I think it's going to be salmon? Uh, I'm going to call it salmon. We'll go with it being salmon because it looks sort of uh, salmon colored once it's chopped up, so we'll go ahead and at least make that guess. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And as I said, yeah. I have no idea what the uh, type of sushi is, so we'll just have to leave it as it is. Okay, so now we have burners, so we can go ahead and do rice. So now we can make what I would suggest is more real sushi instead of just a piece of fish on a uh, piece of seaweed. Alright, rice in. Yeah. Uh huh. Alright, this person still just wants my uh, salmon on yeah. a piece of nori. Mm hmm. Alright, third person does want rice with theirs. So we'll get that over to him. Grab this other rice container. Put it on to cook. Boy, we have plenty of rice going. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I will have to say that compared Compared to the uh, yeah. Pizza Bros, I do find the Sushi Bros a bit more challenging. Mm -hmm. With the Pizza Bros, it was really nice that it's like you cook one pizza and it serves four customers. So, a lot easier to take yeah. care of things than this. Mm -hmm. This is still not too bad. And it'll be a lot easier once I have my uh, waitress in here as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, do you want rice as well? There we go. Get this out to you. Yeah. Uh -huh. Alright. Six customers served. Not bad when I'm running a restaurant by myself. Alright. Oh, so evidently we weren't serving on Nori before because now I can actually get Nori. Interesting. And I don't have enough money for it. So, right now, let's just continue. 
So I don't know what the uh, green is that the fish is put on when it's just plain. Yeah. yeah. If it's not nori. Uh huh. Mm hmm. All right. Get that one on the boil. Get that fish out to that person. Get another rice on here to cook. Get you some fresh fish here. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Didn't want to just put the plate down for a moment. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Get him served. Then we'll get this other person a fish as well. Then I need to put some more rice on. go so a bit more business today but not too bad at all still yeah. mm -hmm. we'll just cut it over here and there you go yeah uh -huh. all right Do you want rice or no? You don't want rice. All right. Yeah. Uh-huh. All right. You do want rice. Woohoo! Do you wish that I didn't have to put the plate down every time? It makes it a little bit more inconvenient. Woohoo! All right. Don't think I'm going to get another customer in that's going to be able to be served yeah, in time. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. Nope. All right. Well, not too bad. $132 and a customer served. Now I should be able to get the nori. So let's go ahead and get that first. Then next time we'll get the edamame, probably. Yeah. Yeah. Uh huh, uh huh. All right. And this one's just with the rice. Get some more rice going on here. I like to have two things of rice always ready. That way, even if it gets busy, I got plenty of rice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alright. Uh-huh. Alright, now this person's more like my, myself here. They just want rice and the nori. I can respect that. Still not sure what it's called. Really, the only kind of sushi I've ever enjoyed has been the uh, cucumber roll. Where it's just cucumber, rice, and nori. Okay, so we got yeah. a sumo here. Yeah. Go. All right. Uh-huh. Seems to be a cheery fellow, so that'll work out all right. Get him that. We'll get this rice dish out there. Go. Okay, he's going to want more food. Gotcha. Yeah. All right, gonna have to wait on that order just a moment as I gotta get some rice cooked. Yeah. There we go. What okay. would you like? All right, people are liking just the rice and nori. That works out for me. Yeah. Got plenty of fish here, and mm -hmm. I've got rice ready. So all is good. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh, get that order out easily. Get some more fish prepped here. I think that'll be enough fish yeah. overall, probably. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Go. Uh 
Get that to the sumo. Did not grab this to get the... Go! Alright, then he just wants a fish. Yeah. Oh, didn't get it to him in time. Oh well. Go! Still 11 customers served. Over $200 there. So I'm doing well. Alright, we'll get the edamame next. And let's see here. We need to impress the food critic. That's all we have left to do, I think, on this first level. So, let's get to it. Okay, so we had to cook the edamame as well. Get that going. Mm -hmm. Alright, this person just wants fit, or just wants rice. We'll yeah. get a couple of fish there ready. Mm -hmm. Alright, I really could use another container for rice. So I'm going to go over here, grab one. Uh, yeah. Alright, Princess uh -huh. Jaime. I think that's how you would say it? I don't know exactly. But that's what I'm going to go with. Alright. She wants some edamame, so we'll get that to her. And then she wants the uh, works... Sushi roll. So we'll get that to her. This guy also wants the works. So we'll get that out to him. Alright, need a few more fish in here. edamame. I'm going to get this to him real fast. And then I'm going to put some more edamame on. And then let's go ahead and get fish. It works out to him. Okay, so evidently the princess is a princess. And if she doesn't get what she wants right away, she cries. That will get annoying real fast. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. I'm gonna grab another one of these. Yeah. Ah, I missed the fish. Alright, let's take this out to this guy since he's been waiting patiently. This will be so much easier when I have a waitress. Alright. Yeah. Put some Nori with that. Uh -huh. Woohoo! Go! Why will that not... Oh, I need water in it. Probably a good reason. Alright. Let's get this out to the sumo real fast. Oh, that wasn't what I wanted. Well, I sort of polluted there a bit. Yeah. Hopefully no one sees that. Mm -hmm. Let's get this out to this guy. And... Doubt I'm gonna... Yeah. I just dropped the plate into the water instead. So I am polluting a little bit, but ah well. Okay, we can do soy sauce as well. Well, let's go ahead and get that.
And we have this food critic coming. Uh, evidently he's coming today, by the way. The thing I keep thinking is, isn't he going to ask questions of why we're getting fish out of the river? I mean, I'm guessing it's a good river at least, or I hope it is. Uh, because otherwise we are violating a few rules, I'm pretty sure. Alright. So let's see. We need soy sauce. And evidently that's how you make soy sauce in this game. You just put it down on uh, the soybean down and chop it and you have soy sauce. Alright. That is not what I needed, so... Mm -hmm. Let me get more rice cooking right away here. Alright. Get this guy his food real fast, then we'll deal with the screaming princess. She wants it works. And she wants soy sauce. Yeah. Uh huh. All right. He's gonna want the works and edamame. We'll get that for him here in just a minute. Let's get him his stuff first. Even though the other guy wants something, he's the food critic, and so I care about his needs before others. Alright, let's get this out to him. Then we'll get that other guy his edamame. Alright. Uh-huh. Wow. Okay, he wants the works. Eh, it hit the floor, yeah. but five second rule, it's fine. Mm -hmm. All right, we got that out to him. Let's get his soy sauce chopped up here. I love the way this restaurant operates. We got our fish coming out of the river, and we got our soy sauce that we just chopped by hand. All right, let's get this to him. Mm -hmm. You know what? I want two things of rice. Oh, I gotta get him his soy sauce still. I haven't forgotten. All right. So because I don't want to hear the princess scream, Let's go ahead and get her her stuff first. And we'll get this person theirs. Want to throw that on there real fast, just so it starts cooking. Get this soy sauce chopped up for her. <laughs> I just even saying that's funny. finish the last order, but that's alright. Food Critic should be good. Food Critic was impressed. That's all that really matters. And with that, we've completed our first upgrade, I think. Yep, we can renovate the building. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. If you enjoyed the episode, please go ahead and click that like button. And if you have not already, please subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon so that you're aware when I produce new videos in the future. Thank you. And as I've said before, I would recommend eating somewhere other than here.